kept in a small bowl, the goldfish will remain small. With more space, the fish will grow double, triple, or quadruple its size. It occurred to me then that perhaps the reason for my growth was that I was intended for larger things. After all, a giant man can't have an ordinary sized life. There were two roads out of Ashton, a new one which was paved and an older one that wasn't. People didn't use the old one anymore and it had developed a reputation for being haunted. Well, since I had no intention of ever returning to Ashton, this seemed as good a time as any to find out what lay down that old road. Now there comes a point when a reasonable man will swallow his pride and admit that he's made a terrible mistake. The truth is, I was never a reasonable man. Welcome to you. What's your name? Edward Bloom. Hmm. Bloom like a flower? Yes. Oh, here. Here you are, right here. Edward Bloom. We weren't expecting you yet. You were expecting me? Not yet. You must have taken a shortcut. Why, well, yeah, yes, I did. It, it almost killed me. And you're here now, and that's what matters. Well, what is this place? The town of Spectre. Best kept secret in Alabama. I have to meet somebody, and I'm already running late. Now, son, I already told you. You're early. <laughs> I agreed to spend the afternoon, if only to understand the mystery of how a place could feel so strange and yet so familiar. Did you see that woman? Was she naked? Yes, she was. It's not a woman. It's a fish. No one ever catches her. How old are you? 18. I'm eight. That means when I'm 18, you'll be 28. And when I'm 38, you'll be 48. That's not much difference at all. Sure is a lot now, though, huh? I, I, I have to leave. Tonight. Promise me you'll come back. I promise. Someday when I'm really supposed to. The auction today is for the town of Spectre, all streets, lands, buildings, and accoutrements there, too. The opening bid will be 10000 50000 You must be Edward Bloom. How do you know? You're buying the town. You see, in order for the town to be preserved, the trust must own it in its entirety. Now, I'll offer you more than it's worth, and of course, you won't have to move. Nothing will change except the name on the deed. You have my word. Yeah. Why are you buying this land, Mr. Bloom? Some sort of midlife crisis? I'm sorry. H have I offended you? No. You did exactly what you promised. You came back. I was just expecting you sooner. <laughs> 